Good morning. Welcome to Out Morning Devotion. Glad you are tuned to the Morning Encounter. It is our prayer that you will encounter with God through this broadcast. And now, let's welcome the servant of God. Good morning, uh, dear viewers. We thank God that we have been able to wake up to connect with us in this on this morning devotion. God is a faithful God. He has been able to make us be able to be who we are and just to rise up and be able to listen is something that we can thank God. Yesterday, we began a devotion and looking at how God makes us to light uh, our light or his glory in darkness. And I promise that I'll be taking out through things that you can be able to do to light this darkness. And today, I want us to look at character. And I will be based on my reflection from the book of Daniel. Daniel with his friends, they were able to stand out as people that are able to do all that God wanted them to do. In this particular place, we see David, uh, we see Daniel, sorry, a man of character, a man that distinguished himself. He lighted himself. He chose to walk with God with his character. And the Bible talks about Daniel, that he and his friends, they were chosen and they refused to be defiled by the thing that were in the kingdom. In, no, it was a Babylonian kingdom. And for many of you who read the Bible, Daniel was actually a Hebrew. And he was able to distinguish himself in his way. He chose his way. I shared with our congregant on Sunday that if you allow God, if you allow the divine to define you, then there is nothing that will confine you. You are able to radiate God's glory irrespective of anything. And this calls us to character. Who are we on the road? Who are we in our houses? Who are we in that business? Who are we in church? Does our character define us? What do we do? Our habits. Daniel is actually exemplified as a man that had habits, habits of prayer. Habits of following God. Habits of walking with God and doing all that it pertains to the kingdom of God. In one instance, as many of us have been able to do in this month of January, and as we go ahead, is that he was able to fast 21 days. It is said that it actually takes 21 days for you to develop a habit. He had a character of godliness, a character of seeking God. And I want to encourage you, child of God. You are going through something and you want a breakthrough, you want light to shine. You know, the light that shines in our life needs, has a socket. Unless somebody wakes up from the bed and go and light and put on the, the switch, it may not light. And I want to call us to evaluate our character as we move into the year, as we want to shine, as we think about how to radiate God's glory, how to shine in our marketplace. We check our talk, we check our walk, we check what we do when people are not seeing us. That is character. When people hear your name, like myself as Pastor Bire, who am I in terms of my character? So in this particular morning devotion, as you get into the work, as you look unto God, I want to encourage you that you are going to shine. But are you positioning yourself in the manner that God will look unto you and say, this is my son whom I'm well pleased. Yeah? Who, this is my son, whom I'm well pleased. This is a very good commendation that many of us would want to be said uh, about us. And I want to invite us to think about that and wish you the best as you get into the year, as you get into the day, as you get into the week, that you can trust God to shine his light by you checking your character, by walking with him, what you talk when you're in the company. You know, people have said that check what you say when you're with your people and check your thoughts when you are alone. You can check your thoughts. And as we go into the day, maybe your thoughts are negative, maybe your thoughts are not quite this encouraging. I want to encourage you. Encourage yourself. Because your character are determined by your inner feelings. They are determined by your thoughts. They are determined by your conviction. Let's pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you. We honor you. Indeed, Lord, you who looks at the heart of man, look at our heart this morning. As we go into the day, we pray for happiness. We pray for joy. We pray that we're going to help us to be able to look unto you with positivism, O oh God. Be able to look unto you and know that it's a God that is working out something for our good, even things that are not working on for our good, O oh God. We worship you and we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
that was the morning encounter. We are glad that you tuned in. Follow us on YouTube at Citamel Dorit TV. Our Facebook page is Citamel Dorit. Our Twitter and Instagram handles at Citamel Dorit. And our website is eldorit.citam.org. Let's encounter again tomorrow morning, same time, same place.